Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sharnice and welcome to Simply Nikla. Today I'm going to talk about one of my favorite books and the book that got me started on the romance train of reading all kinds of romance novels. That book or that series is Fifty Shades of Grey. So I have all three of the Fifty Shades of Grey um, novels as you see here. But I also as told by Christian of Fifty Shades of Grey and I have all those books as well which they all are right here as well I got them all so today I'm gonna compare Anastasia's view to Christian's view to Anastasia's books to Christian's book and tell if it's worth of getting the Christian books or not just anything like that that if you haven't read the as told by Christian yet and you always was curious and I'm here to tell you if it's worth it or not so if you want to know about this sit back relax go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel down below I do all kinds of other book things as well and give me a like if you like Fifty Shades of Grey but other than that let's get started with this video and I can wait so we can break about the so to compare these books, first I think just go by size, like these are each of the first Fifty Shades of Grey books, the size of the, each book, but here is the size of all the As Told by Christian books, and they're almost about the same as the others, but the third one, like come on now, that's a thick book. So if we compare by visually what the last book of the main Fifty Shades of Grey uh, book to the As Told by Christian, like this obviously more to the story there's more to in it because look at the size it's such a difference it's like double the size of the main book so that's like a good point right there that you might be getting a little bit more than just the main story for all of us who have read Fifty Shades of Grey we all fell in love with Anastasia's point of view and of the, of the whole story but if you haven't read as told by Christian uh, Fifty Shades of Grey edition it doesn't disappoint you at all like you, you get all like the missing points that you didn't get in the first book and then like you get his point of view of all the situations that happened but also you get um, the times when Anastasia and Christian wasn't together you get those particular events in these books so there's obviously the main spectrum of the story but there's added bonus scenes that we didn't get to get within the as told by Christian story when Christian wasn't with Anastasia like for example you know I mean I'm not gonna go too deep within the story we all know the story if you haven't read Fifty Shades of Grey like what is your deal but you know like his point of view of the wedding and then like in the as told by christian you get more parts of the wedding that we didn't get with anastasia's point of view of the book and remember when anastasia told christian she was pregnant and then he left and when he came back we know that he was with, with mrs robinson but in the, the as told by christian book we get that part we didn't get in Anastasia's book of knowing what the whole conversation what was the whole deal with Mrs. Robinson within this book and you get see his point of view and see his emotions and how he deals with everything with Anastasia and so you get like that missing holes within the story I can't really say like which one's uh, point of view is better um, I feel like Anastasia's point of view is magnificent just as much as Christian's but it just fills the holes of what we didn't get um, within the first book with Anastasia's point of view just like when there's books that have both point of views within a story we feel like we get the full story once we are read everything and then with these books we finally got like the full story of what both of them felt and both of them seen with the same situation with the As Told by Christian books, you get more connected with Christian and how he deals with things. So I guess what I say is worth getting the As Told by Christian Fifty Shades books. Of course, it's totally worth it. Like I've been saying throughout this whole video, you get a whole extra bonus. It's like a old story revamped in a way because it's the same story, but it's totally different because it's a different point of view. I just really love the whole world of Christian and Anastasia and reading his side and his point of view lets me get to be within the world of Anastasia and Christian again and reliving the story. I love the movies and I love the book, the first set of books and 
Christian's books is just as good. I 100% love Fifty Shades of Grey and I love Fifty Shades of Grey's I was told by Christian series um, as well. So if you haven't already, go ahead and read it and try it. The story is so much, is so much more. I just want to make a little video talking about my first book that I fell in love of reading romance novels. And if it wasn't for my sister reading this book first and telling me to read Fifty Shades of Grey, I wouldn't probably have to start reading. And I thank her for that. So thank you so much for watching this video. I catch you back next week with another cool one and I hope you like this one. Give a like down below if you did and subscribe for other book content that I do. Bye!